Just to take me on, take me in, set it aside. I'm gonna get my heart. What is the name of the song? Hello, Zachary. What's up? How are you? I'm good. We are obviously so excited to have you on the React channel. Super happy to be here, thank you. While Shazam may usually be your magic word, today it's gonna be your arch nemesis. We're gonna play a game of Guess That Song oh, called yes. Shazam vs. Shazam. Of course. This is the grudge match to end all grudge matches. You're gonna be hearing some familiar and beloved songs that span your career as well as a few that don't. And you're gonna be playing against the ultimate opponent, Shazam, the music identifying app. Okay. Spanning my career? Mm-hmm. Songs that would be affiliated to things that I was in and did? Correct. Oh, well, <laughs> Sorry. I thought this was gonna be difficult. Okay, here are the rules. We're gonna play you and Shazam one second of a song, and the first to guess correctly gets a point. If neither of you get it, we'll be adding time until we get to 15 seconds. Okay. I didn't even know Shazam, you could like start and stop, you can pause that thing while it's doing its thing? I'm gonna restart it every time. <laughs> Feels like a disadvantage to the app. I'm sorry, Mr. App. Here goes our very first second of your first song. Uptown Funk. Bye. Bruno Mars. From. From? What do you mean? Did you recognize the sound of that? Oh, well, Alvin and the Chipmunks. Oh, am I am I guessing the movies? Do I gotta guess the song and what was it? You just the song and the artist. Okay. So the title and the artist, I'm giving you a little bonus. All right, all right, all right. Technically, you should know that. I'm one. in for bonus points, guys. I'm in for the bonus. I like pop dance music, so. <laughs> You're in my wheelhouse, guys. Am I talking loudly? I can't tell. I have headphones on. Good job. One point on the board. Sorry, Shazam. Other Shazam. Here we thank go. Thank you. Yes, thank you for clarifying. You can Here. call me Billy. Oh, perfect. Billy Betts. Here's your next. I wanna oh, wait. Uh, this is a short skirt, long jacket by Cake that was the uh, opening, uh, our title song from the show Chuck. Shazam doesn't know this. Well, but it's because it, it's an algorithm. It takes a second. This is why humans still have a little bit of an edge, guys. We should have faith. That's actually one of the greatest things about the show was the soundtrack. There were a lot of indie bands that a lot of people found through, through including myself, who, you know, found through the show. Here is our next song. If I quit your beer. Um, I can't, I can't do it. Hip hop is not my strongest category. If I quit your beam, I still rock my. Look it to your left. Oh, well then I think he got, <laughs> wow. That was two seconds. Bam. Sit down, be humble. Well done, you. They use it in the, uh, our first uh, trailer. Yeah, series of trailers, yeah. It's such a great, I mean, he's so, incredibly talented and fantastic and the song's great and it was a really cool way to splice into the film for sure. Uh, uh, that would be, that would be uh, Unless I See the Light in, uh, sung by myself and many more in the movie Tangled. Feather in the cat, that one, that's a gem. Everyone should go see that multiple times. If I didn't get that, that'd be pretty sad, actually. What does it feel like to be a part of an iconic Disney movie like that? Uh, I mean, honestly, kind of like what it feels like to be Shazam. It's it, it's all like these massive, massive bucket list things that when I was a little kid, I genuinely believed that I could do. And now I've been able to do. Being a kid who grew up in Southern California and went to Disneyland all the time and watched everything Disney and was a Diz nerd like to the nth degree, to be that little boy who got to be a Disney prince, um, you know, that, that was just super kooky. Okay, here's your next. I, I no no I, I know Wait. the song um, like I, I, this is, is I'm I'm a little embarrassed because I should actually know for sure who <laughs> who uh, performed this song and what the name of the song is. Look to your left. Oh oh, you already got. <laughs> I love that I'm so lost in trying to figure it out. That this guy, whatever, immigrant song is the name of that song. Okay, whatever, dude. Oh, I'm, I'm technology. This was the immigrant song by Led Zeppelin from the Thor Ragnarok soundtrack. Thor Ragnarok, that is absolutely correct. It was super cool that I got to be a part of the Thor franchise in general. When it dawned on me that I had been in the Marvel universe, the, the DC universe, and the Disney universe, 
I was like, I, I know that's so rare. Like, I'm, it makes me very, very, very grateful when I, you know, can slow down enough and just be like, hey, wow, this is really cool. Don't. Oh, I know this. Uh, can you play it one more time? Let's give you two seconds. Don't in oh. Oh. Is that right? Uh-huh. Oh, I wouldn't have known that. I don't really listen to the radio as much anymore, but I do miss a, a lot of stuff that you know, you know that the radio's gonna like, just keep pumping and pumping and pumping. Yesterday I... That, <laughs> that's the song, She Loves Me, sung by me in the Broadway recording of the Broadway show, She Loves Me, that I did in 2016. I'm very good at spotting myself, guys. The narcissism. This is our last song. We have at best a tie or you win. <laughs> All right, we got options. Good. Uh, <laughs> just serving up all the Zach hits. Uh, that was, um, uh, it's, uh, what's the name of the song? <laughs> it is, she was on the show Smash and she was in Waitress and she's lovely and What's her name? <laughs> Catherine McPhee! Catherine McPhee! Hey! And uh, so, me and Catherine McPhee. The name of the song is, um... Uh... <laughs> what is the name of the song? Do you want two seconds? Uh, uh, sure, why not? You I, got this. Actually, you know what? Yeah, give it to me, because I want to see if Shazam can recognize it. All right, ready? Right we'll see. <laughs> Terrified. Could be good. Never mind, got it. Came to me. I didn't hear it. I was just acting terrified. That's what I was trying to get across. Hey, look, Shazam eventually got it. Hey! Oh, it was my voice too. Fantastic. We've got a five, two, three final score. You won. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. I feel I feel pretty good about that. I feel pretty you okay? We good? We good. I can't believe you beat a robot. What? You mean are you judging me for doing so? Oh, you're just shocked that I was good enough to beat the robot. I got you. I got you. I thought you were thinking. I was like, how dare you? Little Roombas come out and start attacking me. Like, oh god, it's starting! Did you like playing with us? Was that I a did. fun game? I did very much. Thank you. Okay, we're really happy you were here. You were very knowledgeable in the music space, and we're very happy you came. I tried to be. Thank you for having me. And go see Shazam on April 5th. Hey, everybody, thank you so much for watching Shazam versus Shazam on the React channel. Are you going to go see my new movie, Shazam? Please let us know in the comments. Subscribe. There's new shows every day. If you like this episode, hit that like button that likes things. Adios.